Hi guys, uh, welcome to this short video about an interesting problem which I have found regarding the 7-zip. I mean, 7-zip, that's basically the standard which we are using when it comes to free uh, zipper tool. And I wanted to put a file or a couple of files into a zip file and it didn't work. It came up with an error message like I don't have access to a file which is really weird because I actually have access to this file and I wanted to show you uh, what happened and how you can work around this problem. So I'm just taking any random file here. It's a locally on the C drive, more or less on the root. I think it was part of a Microsoft installation package, but as you can see, I can open that easily. It's Microsoft software license terms and I can read and open and do everything. So it doesn't look too bad. And uh, when I want to add this file with a right click to a new archive here, um, yeah, I'm not doing anything except putting this into this zip file, no password, no nothing, just standard. Click on that and it says access is denied. Cannot open this file here, this file name. Yeah, that's super weird here. And I have definitely write authorization even on the root. Maybe it's not full uh, access. I don't know. I mean, when I make control C and control V, uh, we can go here and you can see it's uh, copying this file and writing on the root of the C drive. So it shouldn't be a problem, but definitely uh, it, 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 there, there's no access uh, from the 7 zip to this root or I, I, I don't know it, it, it looks like it, it's uh, having some problem and so I'm copying this to a directory uh, which I have made like uh, on the C drive temp directory zip test here I'm copying this uh, file here and here I do the same thing, 7-zip, add to archive, and I click on OK, and it's doing this instantly. So uh, it really is uh, something which is related to the authorizations, I think. I mean, I, you have been able to see that I have writing rights, but usually on the C drive, on the root, I think it's not the best idea to do some operations. Could be a little bit risky and the authorizations are a little bit limited and I think there are also other directories which uh, have same or similar limitations like program files and, and other things so uh, just copy it to uh, some user uh, directory and do the things there and you shouldn't have any problems. By the way, during the time when I was editing the video, I found a second solution. You just can hit the Windows key, type or enter a 7, then right click here on 7-zip file manager and select run as administrator. Of course, you have to click on yes here. We can close this thing here and then we are on the same view we have the root or just go there wherever you want to do something so we can click on the file which we want to add to a zip file we uh, hit ok and you can see we have it here already and so that's another solution for this problem so that's it for now i hope i've been able to help you a little bit with this video if you have any questions or comments just write to the comment section below i'm always happy to talk about these things and if you like the video give me a thumbs up subscribe my channel thanks for watching and see you next time